Auntie Pasta. Welcome back to my Let's Play of the Runaway Team. Um, we're just sitting here with Michael and Ruthie and in the aftermath of Connie and Elaine's visit. And you could tell they're both a little bit uh, perturbed, I guess, <laughs> you could say. Um, it looks like Michael is very tense about his stale surroundings. He is materialistic. Um, and he, he's kind of bored with the, what everything is right now. And I think it might be because his sister visited and she's very, uh, pushy. Yeah. Connie visited. It might've made him remember what it was like to live in a big mansion and have everything just handed to you. And he's working hard and he, she just put him down so bad. And, um, right now Ruthie is kind of bored um, let's see, does she have to go to work in six hours? So she just needs to finish reading a little bit. Um, she's bored with this book, but we're just going to have her read it anyway. And Michael's eating. In this episode, we're just going to focus on working on skills and just kind of, um, trying to get some money together. Michael doesn't have a job yet, and I'm thinking we might need to get a job because he needs to, they both need to get some money going so they can get married in this, um, at this uh, place that they want to get married at, in this church they want to get married in. Um, I also wanted to show you what, what Elaine left behind. I think it was Elaine. She kicked over the garbage. She made a big mess. So we'll let... Um, Michael, go ahead and clean this up, and we'll let him clean this up. And but Elaine did, I did have her do some gardening while she was here because I thought it was funny that I could. It doesn't look like she really. You have to. She has. He has to water. Let's look stuff. at what we had here: tomatoes, carrots, onions. Um. There's only one blackberry bush. I remember snapdragons uh, bringing in a lot of money, and I think we have. There's a strawberry. There's blackberry. Blackberry is bringing money too. That's. Is that blackberry also? No, that's strawberry. I don't think bluebells bring in as much. So he's just, no, don't go to sleep. I don't know what you're doing. Let's see. What are your skill? What you are tired. Um, let's have you harvest all the lemons. I know lemons bring in money. Is that a lemon tree? Yep. And this is a cherry tree. Um, let's evolve this and let's we want to bring in money. Oh no, we have to spray for bugs. Evolve. Evolve. He's going to be so tired. I really, I want to look, I also wanted to look at her aspiration as a best-selling author. What she needs to do for this aspiration. Um, I don't think she needs to be... in the writers, in the, um, writing career. So I might be able to have her quit, but at the same time, they don't have any other money coming in. So Michael needs to get a job. Yeah, it doesn't look like she has to be in the writing career. She just has to write. That would be awesome. Okay. Um, Let's work on her needs before she goes to work, though. I think we're going to... She did get a raise, so she's getting $32 an hour, so that's solid. Um, she's completed her task. She needs to be inspired when she goes in. Her Everything else seems to be okay, so we're going to have her work on writing... Let's resume writing Fudge Brownie. 
<laughs> I'm so weird. Okay, um, and I'm going to have Michael plant another lemon tree. I know he's going to be super tired, but, um, I think it's important to plant these lemon trees. And let's go ahead and, um, does she have any frogs? She has frogs. I guess I need to go ahead and sell a couple of frogs, which is great because we need that money. 120 each. And he can breed his frogs. And then we can get rid of three of them, and they're 120 each. Let's look at. Michael doing this is a little bit more interesting. Okay, so, um, ooh, I forgot to show you. Look at what they found. They found a voodoo doll. I thought that was really, I think he found the voodoo doll. I thought that was really cool. Um, I think that maybe if we plant some more things, we might be able to get some more money. So I want to make the, um, the blackberries, is it blackberries or blueberries? Blackberry bush a little bit better. It's just at nice. And then we'll plant, and then we'll be able to get some money off of that. Here, can you water this before you take a nap? I'm going to have him take a nap. He needs one. He has been working hard and he has to go to the bathroom. So let him use the bathroom and take a nap. And here's Ruthie. She seems a little unfazed now. She's doing a little bit better since um, Connie left. She's not going to let Connie bug her, um, get on her nerves. She's just going to <laughs> roll with it. So Ruthie is okay. She's, she's, let's see where her skills are at. Um, writing is what we need the most. And she's at five. I don't know if she's written any saying that's she has to write two books so we have to get to the next level and um achieve level four writing skills she's already good on that um all right i'm excited to get this aspiration going i was looking i was thinking about what the runaway challenge is and um i meant to look it up before I started, but I forgot. I know that we have to reach a certain goal um, with the, how much the property cost, and um, but we, I do have to finish her aspiration, and also she has to get married and have a child. So I'm very excited about that of Michael and Ruthie having a child someday. She is so bored. This poor woman. Okay, so let's see. Do, do, do. Um, how many hours? She has two hours until work. Let's go ahead and give her something to eat. Oh, my mouse seems like it's working today. Last night I was playing and I just couldn't seem to click on anything right. And I was trying to get people to go on vacation. And I kept clicking and clicking and clicking, and it, it clicks twice instead of once. Maybe it's me. Maybe I have a trigger finger. Look at all these books everywhere, Ruthie. You need to start cleaning up after yourself. I was playing um, The Sims 4 last night, and I've been playing the History Challenge on my own. And I have one of my Sims um, in herbalism, and... It's so much fun, and I, I just found the Will of the Wisps, and that was really pretty. I was excited to see that and do some of that. I don't know if Ruthie will really get into... I want her to get into herbalism, but maybe she should just focus on her writing, because it's kind of a lot. It's kind of a lot of going around and searching, and we just don't have time for that. We don't. Okay, Ruthie has work in one hour. We'll let Michael harvest some things, and when he wakes up, can we evolve? I see a sparkle. Evolve that, 
and he needs to harvest down here. What am I doing harvesting way out in the woods? Um, so let's see. Let's have her go to the bathroom real quick. And then she will be all set. Oh, she has to be inspired. So maybe view that. Will that inspire her? Is this inspiring? Um, that's playful. Here, finish what you're doing. Don't wash your hands. I'm going to not make you wash your hands. <clears throat> okay, let's see what he has so far. Um, let's sell this and I think I might just go ahead and sell the dragonflies maybe we'll just I'm going to give up on the um, herbalism for Ruthie I I think we want her to focus on other things right now and these how are they see it's doing it see okay so these are normal they're just normal um, oh he just picked them that's why um, Look at these. Huckleberries are nice. Oh, uh, let's sell those. 26. This is $7 each. This is $4 each. And I don't know if that's worth to have some of these. Like lemons are $4 each, but when they get better, they're like they could go up to $7 each. So let's go ahead and that's only $12 to sell those. It seems like strawberries let's get rid of the strawberries and what are they doing what are they doing she looks like she's chasing him oh she's going to work bye Ruthie we love you okay um before you go let me see if I can yeah let's breed your frog one more time and Ooh, 120 there we go we're, we're getting there and it's kind of like I was thinking do I try to get the money for the challenge or am I going to try to get the money so they can actually have a beautiful wedding ceremony at a venue so I, I was going back and forth on that and I really found this venue that is just gorgeous and I love it and so, um, see, $11 each. So let's plant a couple of these. That will help us out if we could get, and if we plant them all at once, then maybe they'll, they'll give us what we need all at once. Plant, plant. I just don't like running around everywhere to do this. It's nice to have it all in one spot. All in the garden. He is a flirty sim. He wants romance. He... Poor Michael. I wonder if he should try to reach out to his sister again. He's feeling kind of bad. At least his... Um, materialistic trait kind of went away that not trait but that wants that that sadness that was happening he wants to freshen up in the mirror we could let him do that um he wants to buy an object worth a thousand dollars we're not going to do that honey we're saving money do something romantic take a cold shower that might be a good idea but first let's let you freshen up in the mirror he is sleepy again So, he did get that done, and we sold the lemons, the, I mean, we planted the lemons, so we're okay there, and it's 22, how much is this? Ooh, that is tempting, but I really think he should keep that, you never know with his sister, you never know, he's not happy, let's, let's give him a cold shower and then have him sleep for a little while and then we'll come back after. so Michael decided to invite um, Ruthie on a date and 
they came over here to this church. He wanted to show her the church. Um, well, it, they live on the same island that the church is on, and they, they've always been curious, so they decided to go inside. He didn't get a chance to go inside with his sister because he was busy arguing with his sister. So he um, decided to bring her to this church to take a look at it. And you might have seen this in my the episode with Connie. They came here. Um, just go with him, honey. Go with him. There you go. She's flirty. And I'm thinking that these couches are not what... what I might be wrong, but are not what was here. They might have had something else. Um, because... I don't, I don't know. Here, let's whisper sweet nothings and let's flirt with her. Romance, flirt, and let's kiss her. They're just hanging out in the church area. I think this is pretty with the grass around the arch. Inside the church, I like that. Maybe it's an old relic of a church. And Flirt with your date while flirty. Why is he not getting flirty? Let's make a move. He is a flirty sim. He should be getting flirty. Let's make out. Maybe she needs to flirt with him a little bit. Get a little give and take here. I guess they socialize for ten or ten times, so now they're being enticing. Ooh, get him flirty. He needs to be flirty. Look deeply in the eyes. Oh, she can recite love poetry because she's a writer. Oh, he's flirty. Yay! Kiss your date passionately. Have Sims become playful. Let's see what's going on out here real quick. Um, there's not many people here. I'm really curious about this. I have not yet done this. It would be neat to... Um... Oh, that's pretty! Okay. Uh, take a group photo... Oh, she has to do it. So, take a photo of, I think Michael would take a photo of her. Let's take a photo of her. I think that would be fun. Let's do that. And then he could kiss her passionately afterwards. So let's get them moving. So they're going to go over to the photo place. He, uh, stale surroundings. He's going to this beautiful place and he's thinking how small his cottage is. And he wants it to be bigger. He wants things to be amazing. And he thinks that, oh, this is cute. I love this. This is really fun. Okay, so we can't go too far back and let's see let's frame this does this do medium photo oh cool we can make these bigger this way I didn't know that um that's pretty let's do one and oh that just did two because my mouse clicks twice and let's do this and oh that's pretty I wish I could get closer. I can't get any closer. I'd love to get closer to her face. She's so cute. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba, da -da -da -da. Okay. Nice. I hope these end up in his pocket. Black and white. Eh. Scary. 
And one more. That is really cool. Can we change the background? Let's do it again. Let's change the back and let's put the sky. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay, let's do another photo of, of Ruthie. Oh, this didn't turn out well. Ruthie, turn around. This did not work out well. She's busy. I don't know what she's doing. <laughs> Can she like pose? Um, 10 photo studio, what does that mean? Can you pose? No, let's see what 10 photo studio means. I don't know what that means. Um, come over here. Oops, no, don't come up. Don't do that. Just go over here. I can't make her turn around. Go here. And let's let him take a photo of Ruthie. Maybe she'll get back on there and she'll pose again. I haven't used this, so sorry if I'm... Oh, that's a cute... Oh, that's so cute. Let's back it up a little. Get her little booty in there. She's so cute. They're having fun. Um. <laughs> Something to show your grandchildren. Oh, she's hungry. But he's going to passionately kiss her now. Passionate kiss. Passionate kisses. Passionate, passionate. Go kiss her. Kiss her, kiss her. I want to take your photo. Funny, what just happened? Oh my gosh, this is crazy. This is some amazing kiss, Michael. This is some amazing kiss. <laughs> Look at her face. I'm sorry, I can't help it. I this is so funny. What? His arm is going through his body, I think. Ew. Yep. Oh my gosh, Michael. You have some skills. I'm amazed by your skills. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh no, no, no. That's so scary looking. Oh dear. Oh, look at this. This is cute. I'll go through here. Oh. Her face. This is cute. Wow, this looks kind of... Whoa. Whoa. What are you guys doing in there? Oh my. That was the most amazing passionate kiss ever. Did that count? Because it said kiss your date passionately. I don't know if they really kissed. Yep. Whew, she's all heated up from him, Michael. <laughs> that would heat me up all twisty turny. Okay, so they're hungry. Um, let's go over to the bar. There's some people here. They're all watching TV. And we don't we can't tend bar and I don't want to spend two hundred and fifty on oh, we could do this. Look at that. Um have a quick meal of yogurt. <laughs> they're just gonna go in here and get some yogurt. See what what the staff left behind and eat it. And um, we'll have them sit over here. And we could sit here. What's happening? Okay, cool. They're coming. Let's speed this up a little so they can sit down. Do, 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 do. Come on over. Have your rope. That's not where I asked you to go. You too. This is the most crazy date ever. Um, Ruthie, that's not where I told you to go. Where are you going, honey? That's not where you're supposed to go. This is like da 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 da
Okay. When I was little, I watched Benny Hill. Isn't that bad? That's so crazy. Ugh. Anyway. Little girl watching Benny Hill. With my older sister's boyfriend. And, like, everybody was around. It was like my parents were in the other room. And it just made me laugh a lot. I just... Oh, look. We can light something. Let's see. Romantic sandalwood. Romantic. Hopefully it doesn't start a fire. Ooh, it makes her very flirty. She's very tired, though. And she's very... She's getting stinky. So, their date is almost over. <laughs> I love how their voices get so romantic. And they could talk about repair tips and their... their these sound so romantic. Okay, I was wrong. Sexy pose for her. Cannot start new social event when one is already... Yeah, we're not going to get married right now. Blow a kiss. This is a really nice date, Michael. This is a fun date. I would love going on a date like this. I don't like to get my picture taken though, so, but I think it would be fun with someone you love and you're being silly and fun. The date is almost over, I think. How much? One hour. Well, in stim time. So what else can we do here? Um, we don't want to do that. And I bet she has to go to work, and we just stayed up all night. Four hours until work. Oh, boy. Let's make coffee. <laughs> um, I think this is all we... Let's just view this together, just to get out of the... Um... Now, what are these little triangles for? Is this anything? Is there something there? This is interesting. Is it just a design? It's very, that's very soothing. I really love this setup, how they have the church here and then a reception area, nice bathrooms, but I think my favorite part of this is the, is to be able to take photographs. I think that's my favorite part. So they're just looking at this mannequin in the, the sculpture. Okay, are we done yet? I want to be done. And then they're going to go home. Ruthie has work in four hours, so she better okay, get some They're sleep. back. They spent the whole night out. The whole night out. <laughs> on their date. On their romantic date. So, Michael is one step closer to his aspiration. It looks like he just has to marry her and go on a few more dates. And, yep. I think he is going to do fine. We're not worried about Michael at all. It's Ruthie that I'm worried about. We have to get her going on her writing. I don't know if she'll quit her job or not. I'm going to leave off here, and um, I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Runaway Teen. In the next episode, we may or may not be getting married. We do have money now. We do have 2,387 simoleons, and probably next time we'll have a little bit more because I'm going to let Michael do some harvesting and stuff and stuff. So thank you for watching. If you like this, please leave a comment, leave a thumbs up. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I'm trying to make it to 100 subscribers by November. That will be my anniversary of um, having Let's Plays on YouTube. I'm kind of excited about my anniversary. I think I'll be doing a question and answer um, for my hundred my hundred um, subscribers. I can't think right now. I'm, I'm distracted. It's beautiful out. Yada yada. So um, yeah, I think I'll do a question and answer for my hundred viewers and um, so if you have a question, go ahead and leave it in the comments on any of my videos, and I will put them all together and answer questions on camera. So, 
I hope you have a great day and thank you so much for watching.